What the fuck? What? What? Why are we fighting these things? Celasta, Evo, Malmis. I don't understand why we're fighting them. What? Makes no sense to me. We just saved him. Ah! What? Again? I okay. I guess. Plus eight to hit. That's gonna hurt. I just don't really get why they're attacking me after I just saved their asses. I'm getting the measure of this. <clears throat> Summon a level one beastie boy to keep them occupied. We got, ooh, not sure what that is, but sure, what is that? Conjured Beast, okay. Oh, it's like one of those little Wyvern dudes. Where's Rugen's over here? What? I'm so confused. What? I'm so confused why he's attacking us. <clears throat> Fortunately, they leave me no choice. Think that hits three of them. Celasta, Evo, Malmis. You lose. Oh, it's four of them. Nice. One's dead. Get out the spell back. Uh, create spell slots. Oh, I've only got four. In that case, let's create a sorcery point. Real level one spell. I'll bring it back next. Oof. Okay, well, this is going to wreck this guy. A little conjured dude. Wow. I don't understand why we're fighting them there. It just makes no sense to me whatsoever. Oh, I didn't even see that. I was going to provoke an opportunity. Awkward. Ah, no quarter given. Ah. Rip. Ha. Nothing else, though. That did um, tank a lot for me, so loud and all that. Do a level one smite. I'm gonna take these things down really. There's too many of them. That's I'm unfortunate. Much better. Um let's get another one of these beasts. Natura Hondro Viribe. There's an easy way to hit these without triggering something else, to be honest. Maybe that's a good spot. Celasta, Evo, Malmis. 
Unless what we're meant to do is take out the other guy. I don't know. I don't see how this is ever going to end. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't. I feel like there should be a way that we can. Why would they fight me? It doesn't even make sense. You'll die anyway. It says return to him, tell him what happened. And then we're fighting them. Like, what? I just... Why? How did this... How did we get this spot? Once more, we prevail. They've only got their self to blames, I guess. They started this fight. I didn't want it. Mm-mm. <clears throat> I am so confused as to why we're fighting them. This is mad. This is like the most ridiculous thing I've seen today. Sure, I guess. I feel like this is just the uh, hand I've been dealt, unfortunately. Salasta, Evo, Malmis. Down. Ah! Wait till the next one. Cannot defeat me. Hmm. Oh, yeah, that's a point. Natura and Joe Malmis. Lasta, Evo, Malmis. Ah. Walk it off. This guy hits like a truck, that's for sure. I actually really I am like that unbeatable. guy. Quest there. Why would it? F I, I don't even understand. I mean, it failed because they attacked me. What the fuck. <laughs> Maybe because we started in the thing? I don't know. It just. It's weird. Oh, it's a bonus, isn't it? I want to use power. I want to create a spell slot. I want to create a little five. Thank you. Then we can fireball this guy and turn. It's too far away at this point. It's 
Let me heal you up. Celasta, Evo, Malmis. That's a lot of ones. Dash with a cunning action. Ah, good old jabbing. More. Why can't he heal? Is he? Oh, he's out of power. That's why. I guess can't channel divinity at the moment. Natura, evil, Malmis. Yeah. Thirty. Oh, that's a big save. Very dangerous game I'm playing, but fuck it. Celasta, Necro, Malmis. Ah. 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 Or perish. Celasta, Necro, Malmis. That's battle. I think it's because I just started in their camp, I reckon. Uh, it is the only logical reason as to why uh, they've attacked me on site. Some kind of bug, I suspect. I have a lot of XP from it, though. Oh, a lot of stuff. We get leveled up as well. <laughs> it's part of a quest, apparently. Well, good to know that we can beat them, and that we have beaten them. But I don't understand why. Hmm. Okay. Noted. I'm actually going to save this as giant attack. Why? Okay, well, I've tried every conceivable way of interacting with the giants before they attack us on the site, but in every possible instance, I've tried sneaking, I've tried going through this entrance. Every option, they just attack us on site for absolutely no unprovoked reason. So I guess we just have to deal with the fact that Guardsock is now dead and that the quest failed. I, I can only assume it's some sort of bug. Um... But, yeah, weird. Really, really weird. 
Uh, so what quest have you got? Shire Grave. Return to the city and claim your rewards. Seema Temple. We've got the Badlands Bears. You probably need to do that. And then we've got Talk to Kefrain in Kehifrid. And then we've got the Dryad Queen at some point as well. And we still need to find the silver beetle key. So I think we'll do the butcher and head to hunt the Badlands bears. We haven't done that yet, so we should probably do that. Next. Alrighty, check out these Badlands bears. Let's go. I'm worried about initiative. I'm just happy just to take them out. <laughs> Not even bothered, fam. Bring it on, my dudes. Plus eight to attack. That's not or to hit. It's pretty good. Ooh, that does some damage. These things ain't no joke, huh? Conjure a beast. This is such a good spell. I love it. Adds another uh, target for them to hit. Maybe I should haste, Caitlin. Solasta, Muto, Viribe. Yeah, there we go. Attack that guy. Good. This is a very small area, I think. But is this it? Is it literally just this one encounter? <laughs> okay, I thought this was going to be an entire area. Fair enough. I guess we'll just burn our shit. Two ones, though. Rip. Oh, wow. That does some significant damage. Well, oh, he died. <laughs> Oh, you get extra AC as well, don't you, when you're hasted? Ah! Oh, can he dodge so good? Yeah, let's get another one. I can conjure a load of beasts. Or you have one big boy. Let's go for another big boy. Oh, burning their reactions, I suppose. Every cloud. Ah! Ah! Yeah, these things are actually relatively tough, to be fair. Ah! Do a cheeky little fireball for fucking shits and giggles. Is there a way I can hit both of these without hitting anyone else? Eh, Evo Malmis. That is 31 damage, Jesus. Actually mad how much damage that does. <laughs> fireball the best spell. I can't wait till my fighter has a uh, fireball as well, my paladin even. That'd be nuts. You can't win! You can he win, Captain? Natura and Joe Balmis. Nice move. Good old sneak attack. Solasta, Necro, Malmis, more. Nice. Might have even leveled up off the back of that. Oh, we have. Nice. Beautiful. I think we is done here. I'm going to just go back to Matey Boy. Give him the meat. 
feast your eyes on this. Fantastic! You ever tasted smoked bear? Sure. We need to go. Clear skies, adventurers. What can this lady get you? A room. We need a room. Sure thing. Ten gold pieces. Oh, looking forward to this level up. Let's see what we got. Level six. Uh, aura protection grants a saving throw bonus to your surrounding allies equal to your charisma modifier minus one. Oh, minimum one. <laughs> okay. Charisma's two, so three. So you get plus three to saving throws. Wow. Just for being in his presence. I think. Okay, it's not a big level up then, level six by the looks of it. Expertise, select two proficient skills or tools to double their proficiency. We got athletics, slate of hand, acrobatics, deception, perception. We've already got thieves tools up 10. Wow, that's madness. Uh, investigation isn't bad. Climbing, jumping, swimming, that's also useful to get to out of reach places. We've already got plus seven to slip hand, don't think we need that. Deception might not be too bad. Um... It's already plus five, though. I think I'm going to go perceptions, because that'd be really useful. And then spell. Nope. Verity, what have we got for you? One third level spell slot and survival of the wisest. Your spells are more effective against creatures you already faced. You gain a bonus equal to half your knowledge level rounded up to your spell DC and spell attacks modifiers against them. That's actually really good. But no, nothing else other than that really. And then one third level spell slot. <clears throat> Okay, unlocked class features. Vengeful spirits. You can use a bonus action to call forth the spirits inside you for up to one minute. You can target a 3x3 three three area you can see within 18 cells. Any opponent that enters the area for the first time or a turn or starts its turn there must make a charisma saving throw or take 2d6 plus charisma modifier, which is plus 3. So 2d6 plus 3 in necrotic damage. Half damage on a successful save. Each turn you can use your bonus action to move the area by six cells. Once you use Vengeful Spirits, you can't use it again until you finish a long rest, unless you spend four sorcery points to use it again. Nice. So it's kind of like a um, a mini moonbeam. That's pretty cool. Unlearn Spell. No, I don't think I will. Slow could be good. As could fly out, could counter spell. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So many good shears. I think counter spell is almost too good not to use. The popular singer Panic has been sentenced to be whipped for a seditious. Even though I love slow, flies you. I'm gonna go counter spell. It's just too good. You don't even need to prepare spells. Once you know, know them, you know them. Nice. What does this do? Non-magical weapons can plus one weapon.
Per two spell slots over level two, plus one item, max three. At level four, then you can cast this on multiple items. I won't go for that now, but that seems like quite a cool spell for the future. Oh, cool, 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 cool.